I started off the day with some bigger plans in mind. I wanted to fish for musky, which I did for a few hours with this being my closest encounter. GoPro, start recording, GoPro, start recording, GoPro, start recording. I see a musky. I see a musky. Literally saw a musky. Oh my gosh, that was a big one. Now, unfortunately, that musky did not want to bite, but seeing how calm it was with a bunch of bugs on top of the water with minnows busting absolutely everywhere, I couldn't resist but to throw some top water because I knew I would absolutely slay these smallies. And that's exactly what I did. There he is on the popper, dude. Oh, goodness gracious. Yup, yup. This is what you call football, by the way. Yes, dude, that was a sick eat. That was a sick eat. You literally could not ask for a better morning out here on Lake St. Clair, dog. Oh my goodness gracious, this is so beautiful. It was at this point in the day that I was actually fishing for musky, but you'll see these clips in a different video. I got something big planned for this as soon as I finally catch one. But after a few hours of nothing, that's when I switched over to small. So there's a ton of those little fish flies sitting on the top of the water. So I'm thinking a topwater bite is gonna get the job done today. I've already seen like a number of fish busting on top. So we're gonna see what happens. Maybe I can get a topwater smallie. That would be absolutely insane. What the fudge? Tell me why I just saw a goldfish swimming in the lake. And tell me why I just got a knot on my line. Dude! I literally made a cast as I was just about to turn on the GoPro. Something just destroyed my popper, but he missed it. He's not coming back for it though. Oh my gosh, I was supposed to be filming a musky fishing video today, but if I can catch smallmouth on top water, um, yeah, that's not gonna happen, I'm sorry. Oh my gosh, there he is. No, he came off. Dude. Smalley on top, that's insane. That's crazy, 13 feet of water and they're hitting top. Oh, there's another one, literally another strike. He missed it though. See if he comes back. I've had three strikes in the matter of like a few minutes, but every single one, it's on the pause and they miss it. Make that make sense. How did he miss it again? I don't know what else I have to do differently. I literally just popping it on the pause swipe and miss it off the back i mean it's good we're getting strikes but it's just kind of frustrating because like how do they keep missing it oh my gosh these bugs are insane they are just literally everywhere that, that's probably why they're hitting top water is all these bugs on the top of the water so they're just looking up right now there he is on the popper dude yes sir please let me land a fish on the top water little tiny small jaw Yep, there he is, dude. That's so sick. Top water eat on St. Clair, dog. That is what I've been looking for all day. Oh my gosh, gushness. I don't even know what I'm saying. Come here, bud. All right. They just, I, they just don't stop fighting. Oh my good, oh my goodness, dude. I'm the little ultralight rod. I would, I love to bring my small gear because it's just so much more fun to fish for these fish on small gear, light gear. You know what I'm saying? Small gear. There we go. All right. I mean, that's not a bad one right here. I, I just can't believe 13 feet of water and they're actually hitting top water. That is just crazy. Holy moly. Love to see it. Probably easily like a two pound small jaw right there. Beautiful catch on the day. And we're gonna send you on your way, bud. Back down to the depths he goes. Well, maybe not the depths because he freaking hit top water. These fish are just busting everywhere around me. That's why I had to throw on top water today. Just to see if I would get a bite. And I am. Smallmouth. Literally a smallmouth. I see him right there. He's cruising the bottom though. I don't think he's gonna bite the top water. That small is on the bottom. Other ones are busting, so I guess they're kind of everywhere. Oh my gosh. Oh goodness, there he comes. Boom, it's a little small one, but I will definitely take him. He came up out of absolutely nowhere and just crushed that boy. Come here, bud. Yes, sir. Oh my gosh. Top water smallmouth, dude. You, you, there's just literally nothing that can beat it. I mean, besides maybe like catching a muskie or something, which uh, I was doing that earlier today and did see one. So that's cool. Oh my gosh. Just trying to land you, man. Just trying to land you. So I did see a muskie today, but I didn't catch him. But then I started seeing these beautiful smallmouth bust on the top and I, uh, I had to give up on the muskie because, um, you know, top water smallmouth, <laughs> I just have to. Beautiful, beautiful little bronzy right there. I'm having a blast right now. That's all I have to say. See you later, bud. I'm trying to catch like a six pound smallmouth right now. That's what I really want in my life. Imagine that six pound smallmouth on a popper. It'd be wild. There's another smallmouth down there. Dang, there's a lot of them cruising the deep. 
Oh my gosh, and there's one cruising the top right there. <laughs> As I'm literally looking at another smallmouth, I get absolutely crushed. Come here, bud. Oh yeah. <laughs> this is literally nuts. This is literally nuts. Oh, that's a pretty good one too. Oh yeah, come here, bud. Wait, no, that's a largey. What the heck is this guy doing out here? I mean, I'll take a good old largemouth, but why the heck is this dude out here? That is nuts. That's pretty funny. Such a sweet catch right there. All right, bud. See you later. Holy, there's gotta be a fish there. There's just a ton of tiny little minnows busting the surface. We cast right in the middle of all of them. There's gotta be something there. Well, apparently my GoPro wasn't recording the catch, but I just caught this one right here. All right, guys, he's not as big as I initially thought, but that is still a beautiful smallmouth. Every bit of like two and a half pounds, beautiful fish. All right, we're gonna send you back on your way. Let's freaking go, man. Goodness gracious, that was a big eat, dude. Oh gosh, that's the, that, 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 I don't even know what I'm saying. That's a big fish though. That's a big old small jaw. Dude, that's a big small jaw. Come here, bud. Maybe, is he big? I, don't, I can't even tell if that's a Mondo or if it's not a Mondo. Oh we got, nope, that's a good one. Nope, that's a good one. Yep, 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 yo! This is what you call a football, by the way. If I could grab him. Look at that fish right there, guys. What an absolute stud. I need to get a weight on this bad boy. I don't think it's my PB. I feel like it, she's got to go at least three and a half. Well, scales don't hold on the kayak, but she's around three pounds, 14 ounces. What an absolute stud of a smallmouth right there, guys. Not quite my PB, but definitely a beautiful fish. It's just an unreal day so far. Oh my goodness, unreal. Basically a four pound smallmouth on the popper, just wild, just wild. Oh yes, dude, that was a sick eat, that was a sick eat. Oh my gosh, that's another big smallie. That is another big small mouth. <laughs> this is just wild, this is wild. Oh gosh, that's another big smallie. Oh my gosh, these head shakes are insane. Oh my gosh, there he goes, there he goes. He is not done yet. That's another big old small, that's another big one. It's another big one. Not quite gonna be my five pounder though, but it's another great fish. All right, he's not done yet. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. There he goes in the net. <laughs> this is insane. Oh goodness. Yup, yup, that's a football. That is what you call a football right there. Absolutely insane catch. Oh my gosh, we need to get another weight on this boy. Three pounds, nine ounces right there. Another quality small jaw on the day. Oh my goodness, these fish are absolutely wild right now. Top water is getting the job done. See you later, buddy. I need to catch that five pound smallmouth, I really do. I'm catching like countless amounts of three, four pounders, but I need that five. I used to be a big largemouth guy, but after, after I started fishing Lake St. Clair more, smallmouth on this lake, I just literally can't get enough of it. This is the only place I wanna fish anymore. It's just, it's so much fun. The wind's starting to pick up a little bit and it's getting later in the day. So I'm gonna put away the top water, tie back on this leader and fish a little drop shot here. Oh, there's a fish, yep. Uh, oh, is that a perch? No freaking way. No, holy crap, that's a jumbo perch. Oh my goodness. Grandpa, I know you're watching this. You're gonna be really mad that I'm about to let this perch go. That is an absolute jumbo. I have nothing to keep him in. I have no cooler or anything. If I had a cooler, I would definitely keep him, but I don't. So we're gonna have to let him go. See you later, perch. I'm sorry, Grandpa, I'm sorry. Oh, there's a fish. There he is, come on, bud. Boom, what is it? Doesn't feel that big. Is it another perch or something? Watch it. Oh, no, that's a good small jaw. That's eh, a little small jaw. That's actually a good one. He just wasn't fighting. I don't know what's going on right now. Oh, now he's fighting. 
Now he's, oh my gosh, there he goes. <laughs> he just didn't know he was hooked, I guess, or something. Oh, there he goes, dude. There he freaking goes. Come on, bud. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> yep, that's, a, that's actually a good one too. Oh my goodness. He didn't even feel big and then, then he started going. Nope, he's not ready yet. All right, let's put the net back. Let's put the net back. Let's not blow, let's not choke this. Let's not choke this, that's a good fish. Nope, I'm choking it. I don't know how to net a fish. I can't net a fish. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Dude, I just can't. Literally, the last three fish in a row are all solid small jaws. This guy definitely is another three and a half. Maybe four, maybe, I don't know. Gotta get him on the scale first. Three pounds, three ounces. That's a long fish. He's really long, but he's not that fat. The other ones I caught were a little bit more fat. So I guess I can see it, but that's still a quality fish right there. See you later, bud. Dude, that day, I just can't get over that day. That was so much fun. I just like, I, I couldn't get over it. Top water, small mouth in St. Clair. It's gotta be my new favorite thing to like do ever. So anytime it's calm, I'm dropping everything I have going on in the day, doesn't matter what I'm doing, and I'm going out to the lake, and I'm gonna fish top water for smallmouth, because that was absolutely crazy. I hope you guys enjoyed the video as much as I enjoyed that day, because I just had so much fun. But if you did enjoy this one, be sure to leave that thumbs up, and as always, folks, fish with passion. Uh -oh. Can somebody come and save me? I just wanna know, I wanna know.